Craftsman dual wheel. You'll need your box, your buckets, and your handles. If and when possible for all wheelbarrows, put an extra bucket under the bucket that you were working on so your screws don't fall through. You have your hardware, your leg brace or nameplate, legs, tray brace, axle, axle brace, nose piece. There are four of your longest bolts that are first, the smallest of your long bolts are for your nose piece. The rest will get used later. Take the four longest bolts, put the bucket on the side, put them through. If you cannot have an extra bucket, some wheelbarrows come with plastic washers. Next are your handles. For craftsmen, make sure you have your stripes facing out. Next, your legs with the holes facing towards you. Hand tighten those down with four nuts. With four short bolts and four nuts, put on your nameplate upside down so when you flip it up, it is correct. With the bolts facing away from you. Again, hand tighten. Next to the front, with your nose piece and the shortest of your long bolts, two nuts. And this is the first. These are the first bolts that you will tighten down to lock everything in place. Next are your axle braces on a dual wheel. They face out with the longer on the outside. Attach the back bolt and with the front bolt, attach your tray brace. For dual wheels, you can do both axles at the same time. Again, tray brace. Now we slide our axle through the axle braces. First, your wheel washers. And then your wheels with the air gauge facing out. Wheel washers. cotter pins, and in the front are your last two little bolts and two nuts. You can lift your bucket 
slide it through, attach the tray brace, and tighten it down. Now that we have used all of our pieces and all of our bolts, we can tighten everything down, going down the line, staying in position, and working down this line, staying in position, so that you don't have to continuously walk around the wheelbarrow. If you're spinning, apply pressure on both sides to get the nut to catch the bolt. tight and bend the metal. And you do not want to leave the legs too loose or else those bolts in the bucket can rust. is our finished product. Unstack. Make sure all your bolts are tight and you don't have any gaps in between the plastic and your bolts. Craftsman dual wheel wheelbarrow.